Hello guys, and welcome to my channel. Due to YouTube copyright infringement, we only use one picture with voiceover. Thank you for understanding. If you love history and biographies, please leave a like and a sub. Let's start the video. Nicholas Leonard Suddy Carnot, born on June 1, 1796, in Paris, France, is renowned as the father of thermodynamics for his pioneering work on the theory of heat engines and the development of the Carnot cycle. His contributions to the understanding of the principles governing heat and energy laid the groundwork for the field of thermodynamics. Carnot hailed from a family deeply involved in French politics, and his early education was influenced by his father, Lazar Carnot, a prominent military officer and mathematician. Sadi Carnot's early interest in science led him to study engineering at the École Polytechnique in Paris where he delved into the emerging field of thermodynamics. In 1824, Carnot published his seminal work, Reflections sur la puissance motrice du feu, Reflections on the Motive Power of Fire, where he introduced the concept of an idealized heat engine now known as the Carnot engine. This theoretical engine operated on the Carnot cycle, representing an idealized, reversible process that served as a benchmark for maximum efficiency in heat engines. Carnot's insights were groundbreaking. He recognized that the efficiency of a heat engine depended on the temperature difference between the heat source and the heat sink. This fundamental principle laid the foundation for the second law of thermodynamics, emphasizing the irreversibility of natural processes, despite the revolutionary nature of Carnot's ideas, his work initially received limited attention. Tragically, Suddy Carnot's life was cut short when he succumbed to cholera in 1832 at the age of 36. Despite the brevity of his career, Carnot's contributions to thermodynamics left an enduring impact. In the years following his death, Carnot's ideas gained recognition, especially as the field of thermodynamics evolved. His work became instrumental in the development of the Kelvin Planck and Clausius statements of the second law of thermodynamics providing a theoretical framework for understanding energy transformations. Carnot's insights extended beyond thermodynamics. He also made contributions to the understanding of fluid dynamics, investigating the flow of water in rivers and canals. His work in this area demonstrated his versatile scientific mind, and a commitment to understanding the fundamental principles governing various physical phenomena. In 1834, Emile Clapeyron, a French engineer and physicist, further developed Carnot's ideas, expressing them in a mathematical form that contributed significantly to the formalization of the second law of thermodynamics. The Carnot cycle became a cornerstone in the study of thermodynamics, providing a theoretical basis for analyzing and improving the efficiency of heat engines. Nicholas Leonard Suddy Carnot's legacy is enshrined in the principles that bear his name. The Carnot cycle remains a fundamental concept in the study of thermodynamics, and his work laid the theoretical groundwork for the development of heat engines and the understanding of energy transformations. Although his life was tragically short, Carnot's impact on the scientific community endures, and his ideas continue to shape our understanding of the fundamental laws governing the behavior of energy and heat.